Gary Weiseiker and Etab. Yoshi Pikachu. Seen that a few times already today. Raz now on commentary. Hello, hello, Mike Chickity Check. Now that I'm officially out of the tournament, I'm going to hop on the microphone. And I might not get off, so if you don't like me, you might want to mute the audio. Raz thinks he has something to contribute about Yoshi gameplay. Uh, I didn't even know that this was a Yoshi game when I wanted to hop on, but this is Wiseacre. He's been working. Etab, I lost to his Pikachu earlier today. But we got a win cancel, though, so. Yeah. That's or really or Razzi, as they say in Japanese. I call it a Raz cancel. Yeah, that's really what I should have called it from the beginning, but to, to name something after yourself when you first discover it is kind of uh, the ego that it would take would be a little ridiculous. Nah, I don't think so. What about Wispy Walking? Who invented that? Was that you? Nah, Wispy Walking, nah. I didn't even necessarily invent it. Uh, I learned it from uh, Pete, the uh, Australian Yoshi. Shout out, Pete. SSB. Nice. Unfortunately, the Oh, I could have just went for a don't. shield bag. Don't watch our stream. <laughs> and they don't count because they no, probably I think all oh, Dude, I think... um. Uh, oh, my God. The fact that I'm blank on his name, I spent so much time talking to him. The uh, Quincy, the... Uh, uh, the guy who was here at SmashCon? Yeah, that's scary, dude. That's like one of those situations where you do that down B and Pika just gets there right yeah. before you. Or they throw out a move and you just die anyway. Yeah. Yeah, but Rashi apparently, uh, not, I don't want to make this all about myself, but <laughs> I thought he was going to go for are. a win cancel there. That was like the moment to do it. Nah, he's just going to get a back air and get off stage. And here we go. Tie game. We got ourselves a three stock. Nice Vietnamese rule set. Now, Etab definitely, yeah, Etab was definitely kind of camping uh, platforms uh, versus Yoshi. Like, interesting strategy. Um, I mean, and then I guess just you fast fall in when you feel like it's your opportunity. So maybe, like, kind of the move for, like, Yoshi is to kind of play above, which I know sounds weird. It's just hard to get to that top platform when someone's camping it. He's really working him with the F airs too, building on damage. And the can. back air breaks, but uh, good yeah. reaction to up smash. But the dude, I don't know what's up with the uh, lightning. Like sometimes it feels like it should, like you landed it, and other times not. Yeah. It's, what's it look uh, like up there? Like if you go on like the modded version of Hyrule Castle, where it's like super big, and like will, if you do a down B, will it go all the way from the very top of the sky? Yes. Always. And there's yeah, not always. like a little room up there to like cozy up. I don't think so. Back air will take that. And we see a taunt for the fans. Shout out chat. <laughs> Some forward air. And yeah, a lot of times Pikachu has to just apply that forward air damage and then just back away. Yep. Like you got to gotta be disciplined with Pikachu, Yoshi, and the up be the zip, but no zap. We'll hate take to see, that. Hate to see it happen, but I'm sure... Wiseacre's grateful. Did we see a little Fugazi or something with the uh, Wiseacre's Yoshi 2 or no? I don't think Maybe so. Maybe it's like a even in one of the other games now. Or this is game one? This is game one. I just got here. There again. The forward air. Not a lot oh, of DI Very risky me. forward air because like the, the forward air with Yoshi, if you don't hit it, like it extends your hurt box so yeah. forward. So like you get caught in Falcon up B, you get caught by... Pikachu grab. Like, if you've thrown out a fair, you better hit it, boy. And the egg there at ledge. Hop, just hopping up to the side platform with ledge. I, I, I like taking note. Ooh, that didn't break. Must be yeah, stale. I'm surprised. Yeah. Wiseacre gets another free one. Back on stage. Um, but it's always good right to front. note what they uh what people do when they come off of ledge or when they're playing what I like to call get up from ledge bros because it's a totally different game than Super Smash Bros. Sure, I you can have get that. up from ledge bros and you also have uh inv invincibility bros. Uh, when you take a stock, and s some people are very good at it. Like Super Boom fan, best in the world before like console lag took over, you know? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Best in the world at Invincibility Bros, to, to be specific. Neil's just taking a lot of excess damage. Can't find and anything to kill. These forward airs are so aggressive. He still has a jump, though. 
And look, see, he keeps doing that. that yeah. he's, he's spamming Zitsu hard where he's, he's landing, and then you can see he does the little head bob every time he lands. That's a big part. You really just got to – and I probably do the same thing, honestly, all the time. Well, you would do, like, so many times I took the lead, yeah, yeah. Oh, there's definitely a pattern to it that I probably don't even realize. I just do subconsciously just because I lack the attention span to stay in neutral. <laughs> Something must happen. Wiseacre needs a smoke. Off, he takes a hit camera. of the jewel. We are not sponsored by Jewel. We should say that up front. But if you smoke, it is cool, kids. So you, should you should know that it. tobacco is addictive. And it's awesome. And it makes you cool. It is flowing through Wiseacre's veins. Yeah. We're going to see some... Much, ooh, look at ooh, that. Oh, I just kind of saw. Oh, yeah. He's definitely feeling <laughs> We're it. We're just like, he's just getting grabbed. I think <laughs> he gets one ledge cancel at the start. He gets a ledge cancel at that zero to death. Four dares, four dares. Four dares, four dares, four dares. He gets grabbed. Just so good. And he pauses there. We see a brief moment of what you going to do. And Loses you hate jump. to see it. Put one in the swear jar. <laughs> Oh, I love the taunts from uh, Etab. Look at that. He's the evasiveness. The Ooh. perfect land. The forward air. He tries to chase the tech, but a nice little get up. And what Man. Did I, What am I witnessing? Just lots of trades. Look at the trade. Downbeat doesn't result in a kill. Now he's got to finish it. This is now that weird percent. You got a uh, back air of uh, up smash. What do you, back air is just going to reset neutral again. You know what I mean? You it's just like a punching it, bag that doesn't get knocked down sometimes. And another... Double jump. That's the bane of my yep. existence, too, Neil. We feel for you. Oh, yep. Pika's tail. This is why we'll never be good. And nice Ooh. little zip set to get away. Just reset neutral, and he hits him with an air. Can't get up to the top platform okay. to get anything meaningful. Oh, and that's that weird little bounce. Hippity hop up B. <laughs> And again, another little risky fair, but he wanted to chase tech with it. But maybe, maybe if Pika had teched right, maybe it would have covered. And Gets him with the egg, though. Egg to the face is so dangerous, but he's he's there in time. <laughs> Still just really makes your butthole clench, you know what I mean? A little bit, yeah. Oh, and we okay. get the surprise. Uh, oh, so you don't want to do the double jump before doing that forward air. You should, I think you can just stick hop, and then you can uh, forward air him into the plat, and then hopefully chase tech. Yeah. And risky little for uh, gets Good the DJ armor. There. Thought he was covering ledge with the egg. It was a little too early, so E tabs like, "Hey, I'll take that if you're if you're not gonna eat it." And we're back to neutral, ladies and gentlemen. But probably mostly gentlemen. Oh, and the down air breaks armor, but he just sits at the ledge. Forward air. Oh, and if he doesn't get that little Z head bob thing, he maybe could have reacted to that. And. The perfect oh. land forward air. If he was DIing uh, in, he definitely could have made it, but he probably didn't even expect him to forward it. Yeah, I, yeah, thought he, it, thought I he think that's that's upper. probably why he didn't DI. So maybe it was just like 1,000 IQ by him to know. He's like, he, he doesn't think I'm really going to forward air this, does he? And so that's why he does it. Yeah. And, Neil in, was definitely and then the time it took me to describe that, he already lost another stock. The forward air, that's like a, that's a, or the down air rather, but that's a nice down air where it's kind of like, he didn't have a risk of getting hit. Um, oh. But he was still able to kind of put... Dang, and that's unfortunate. He could have F-tilted, up-tilted. Yeah. All sorts of tilted. Ooh, and it's probably an grab accidental there. grab. He'll tell me that it was uh, on purpose, though. Aren't all Yoshi's grabs accidental? Whether they nah, hit or that's not. not true. Oh, and that down air was like good timing on the down air. He just didn't have the uh, positioning, unfortunately. And Man. another no jump. Tex in. Nice parry. Yeah, Not parry. fast that enough by E-Tab. Another parry. Another oh. forward air that doesn't come out because he's doing it too quick. Sometimes you can be too quick, folks. And that's going to seal the deal there. And the one up air will end Neil's tournament. Well, we all knew how that was going to happen. <laughs> You like to see him at least take one, especially on stream, you know? You yeah. know he's going to study this later. You know yeah. he's going to learn it. And he's going to come back next year. <laughs> and he's going to be even stronger. Letting out ne letting out a big sigh of relief, though, knowing that he's done. Sipping on a high noon. Kind of jealous. Yeah. It's time to I get... I could really use a pineapple high noon. Time to get a little... 
tipsy here, I think. And then just watch the show that these people are about to put on for 